Hello, it's Ashton. And it's John. What up, guys? We're back with another reaction video. In today's video, we're going to be reacting to... Uh, lightning Strikes, Scary and Beautiful by the channel Hyperhead. And this is going to be awesome. I love lightning. It's one of the coolest things. Anything um, that has to do with natural disasters or natural, like... What do you, what would you consider lightning? It's just a nat natural phenomenon. There you go. There you go, yeah. Um, yeah, guys, go and subscribe to Hyperhead if you like this video. It's very important to support the channels you love. Um, this was a suggestion from the Leo Within. Lightning is my favorite, is my most favorite weather phenomenon in my life and wanted to share this video of intense lightning compilation strikes and it's intense. I think lightning is so cool too. The, the amount of power that's released in such a quick, fast, small, it is small. I mean, lightning yeah, it looks big when it streaks out the sky, but the actual beam itself is small and does that much like power in it. That's absolutely insane and it looks, I mean, you know what? it looks badass. I... Like, okay, the one thing that I love about Minnesota is that we have a lot of, like, during the summer months, we have a lot of thunder and rainstorms, which I absolutely love. Like, I'll live for that weather, swear to God. It puts um, you to bed like a freaking baby again. It's amazing. Like, I'll prefer, if every day of the year, I would prefer thunderstorms. I just love them so much. Mm -hmm. Um, But, like, thunder and lightning and rain all of it together like just freaking great so i totally do love lightning too um you guys can also help support the channel clicking that link down below in the description if you throw it down through Streamlabs, we're gonna let you pick one of the next videos we react to just keep it under 10 minutes include the video link title and your email and let's get to this video tune it down though Ooh, damn no, oh, this is a compilation. yeah oh, cool. Ooh, you've seen something else blow up as a side shot from that one. That was awesome. That's not good. No, not at all. Oh my god. Holy shit. Damn. I didn't think that it, I didn't think that it usually hit buildings. Like I know it does once in a while. Like if it's like well what happened my sister when she lived down in Iowa, um her, what what is it called? Like the thing outside Zoe's window, like the AC thing. Yeah. What's it called? The central air system? Yeah, like, I know, like, my sister's got hit, and it kind of hit the side of her house, because that, I think it was because that was there, but, like, I didn't know that it usually hit houses. Yeah, it's going to aim for the tallest grounded thing around, so if your house is the tallest thing around, it's going to hit suppose, it. I suppose, yeah. It's always going to aim for the tallest uh, conductor. Huh. I'm going inside. <laughs> I miss stormy weather, man. Oh my god! Oh my fucking god! That's crazy. Lightning is so cool. It is. Oh god. <laughs> Holy shit, it just obliterated that tree. They had a security <laughs> camera they caught that on. Yeah. Wow. The kind of power that it releases is just crazy. Oh, oh my god, they're <laughs> so, so lucky. It's so oh weird. God, no, it actually did. I was like, they're so lucky, but then the tree fell on their house. Um, I think that's a... Is that a house or is that like a cabin slash resort? Well, whatever place? it is, I don't care what it is, whatever it is, it fell on their house. I mean, if you look at that lightning, it looks like it just slices through the thing like it wasn't even there. It it's just so not. Good. It just goes right through the damn thing. It's awesome looking. Got that on video. Watch. Oh, yeah. That crushed the front of their house for sure. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was a nice fireworks show. I'm getting chills watching this because I just love. Did that guy get shocked? Oh my god, it set off the car's alarm even. Do they know it's gonna strike that tree or something? They must, I don't know. Oh my god, it instantly burnt it, it looked like at the top. Oh god. Oh god, oh my god, that'd be terrible. Right where you're driving? What was that? The ashes came from all over. Yeah. <laughs> it's 
Let's get that transformer right, box, isn't it? Oh, damn. <laughs> oh my god. Are you <laughs> that voice. <laughs> oh my god. It is so fascinating when it hits trees. Now, is it rare for people to get hit by it? Yeah, very it's very rare. rare, yeah. And a lot of the times you don't die, actually. Are you serious? There's one forest ranger, I forget, but it was in a, like, in school, there's this book that we are in, like, a, what's it called, and they brought the whole school together for a... Oh, God. In the auditorium. Yeah, I can't remember the name of it. Some ranger was hit, like, I don't know if it was three or seven, but it was, like, a multiple times by lightning, because he was a forest ranger, and there's this one spot where you're just very likely to get hit by lightning, and... It's How are you going to get hit with that seven times and not die? If it goes right through you, you can survive, and it goes connects to the ground, it just leaves you. You're just a conductor, you know? But, like, trees... But wouldn't it hurt like hell? Oh, well, I don't know. Honestly, I'm sure it would, but the fact that we get a lot of water in our body, it can transfer through us pretty easy. Like, a tree doesn't, you know? It's very solid dense material that doesn't move well, in any like way shape or form. Well, it's like you think about that, and you see how them trees get snapped in half. Oh, it's I know, like, they how explode. does that not happen to us? Oh, if it did, that'd be so nasty. Oh. Just... Damn. You know, it kind of makes me think of like, if God like had a sniper rifle. He's just sitting there like looking with it. Like I'm gonna see if I can hit that thing Maybe from here. He does. You know. Ooh, that was like a quadruple strike to the... Oh, you're yeah, going like towards it, man! <laughs> six times or five? Six? Get out of there. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Now that would... Oh, my God. There's a triple strike to that building. Wow! Damn! Wow. That was intense. Jesus. Get out of here. Oh, that be me chilling there. It's so loud, too. Oh my god. Yeah, that tree exploded back there. It's an easy windshield to see through. Do you remember the time when we were driving? When Did it just smoke that car? Yeah, I don't know. Go back. Damn. Go back again. Why'd you go back that far? It was it coming up. Dude, it totally did. Damn. Do you remember that time when you and I were driving home from up in the cities and it was like the lightning was so bad that the skies literally turned completely white and it kept like, there was so much of it that it just like... Lit up the sky like it wasn't a drop in it. No, it was like nonstop almost and it was so scary because it, it felt like the world was ending. Like, it was yeah. so freaky. That was crazy, yeah. I've that. never seen anything like that in my life. It was literally, like, the longest white... Like, I don't know how to explain it, but it turned white, completely white out in the sky. And it stayed like that for, like, three to four seconds each time that it did it. And it's like, oh, my God, it was just so cringy. It was. Uh oh. It hit their house or what? Look like it. Damn.
The delay in that, wow. Okay. Oh my god, did it hit a car too? Oh my god. That was a weird one for damn sure. That like left an afterglow. <laughs> oh my god, it looks like somebody shot it with a rocket launcher. honestly that was a super fascinating video thank you so much um guys if you like the video go ahead and subscribe to hyperhead lightning's definitely one of my favorite things because it's just so beautiful at the same time destructive it is like both ends of the spectrum right there you know and sometimes it hits something and nothing's phased by it it just passed right through I know. and sometimes you see it hit a tree or a car and it looks like it literally got hit with a missile launcher and just everything exploded everywhere Dude, oh my god, okay, so one year, and this is really weird, I don't know if any, any of you guys have experienced this, but we had a year in like, I think 2009, I believe, roughly, and it was actually winter, like it was like December, or January, so it was completely white out, we had like tons and tons of snow, I think there was actually a snowstorm just prior to it, we had a thunderstorm, which was like the first time in... I don't know how long we had a thunderstorm it was lightning out it, it was thundering it was the weirdest thing ever for winter don't you remember that I don't know you seriously don't remember that this is probably in I think my sister was still pregnant with Jed at the time or she just had had him so that would have been in 2007 2008 it was probably 2008 there. roughly you really don't remember that mm -hmm. it was literally out it was winter out and it was lightning out thundering and i think there was like one other thing and I, my parents were like what the hell how is it gonna thunder lightning and um snow <laughs> snow all at once yeah or something i think we had a blizzard a odd, i yeah. think we had a blizzard at the same time I'm that's weird i'm pretty positive it was a blizzard yeah this maelstrom fucking going it off was above weird you. i don't know maybe we'll look it up after this and see if i can find like if there's still like a news article about it or something there's got to be something on there about it but it was the weirdest thing i've ever seen sounds pretty cool though. i don't remember it no it yeah i'm surprised you didn't because that was really that was really crazy for us to have that happen mm -hmm. i've never seen that happen before have you uh, -uh. no that's weird i don't even think that could happen but i guess i mean i don't know if it was bliz a blizzard I thought, I think it was, but it could have been a uh, rain or something. I don't remember, but it was strange because it was in the middle of winter and that has never, at least in my time, never happened that I recognized anyway. Yeah, because in the middle of winter it doesn't rain anymore. It's just complete snow. Google it. See if it pops up. What's that? What would you call yeah, it? Even? I'll do it. Um, okay. You can talk if you want. So she's Googling it right now, obviously to see like what it was called i mean i'm sure it's got some kind of a name for it lightning blizzard from hell i don't know how to even attempt to search for that you know don't laugh at that <laughs> you saw that right yeah um there's not a spell over here but in other news uh let's look at some of the advertisements pop up how to eat healthy what the hell is that um yeah, I don't know. I don't know how I would find that. You know, it'd probably take me quite a while to find that. Or like, a, there's got to be something on there. I swear it was like in two thousand and like eight or something. Maybe if I type in two thousand and eight, it'll probably like blizzard of April. Um, does it say anything about it actually having lightning though? I don't know. I don't think it's so. so hard, like. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, it would take me a while to look that up, you guys. But it was so interesting. It was so strange. 
I never thought anything like that would ever happen because usually in the winter months, you know, stuff like that doesn't yeah. ever happen. You don't see lightning when it's that cold out, that's for no, sure. No, or thunder. Thund- it was thunder. Well, they- lightning or thunder and lightning come together. Well, no, I'm just saying like either or. Like it just is strange to even think of either of them happening in the winter. You know? It is, yeah. Um, anyway, but guys. Didn't it thunder? Didn't it do that? Like, I swear, in like November or something this year. Maybe. I swear it was thundering. It wasn't cold enough out yet, probably, though. I don't remember. I mean, it's pretty cold, but not quite. Um, guys, go and subscribe to Hyperhead. It's important to support the channels you love, and peace out. Bye.